Welcome to Weights and Who Studios. My name is David. I'm gonna to talk to you about how I came from being a coach to a filmmaker in the sports and fitness industry. I've only been doing this for four months, but I do call myself a filmmaker because- 16. You're not that guy, pal, trust me. You're not that guy. Okay. <laughs> I've definitely spent all my time on YouTube watching different types of how-to videos. But before I show you this video, this was my first time doing filming or actually being in a boxing gym. The experience was very different. This was a little bit different because a boxing gym, you hear grunts, but they're not the same. It's like people kind of hitting bags. And especially when they go into the sparring session, they're hitting each other. And I'm like, okay, this is not like you versus you. This is you versus someone else, which is slightly different. You never know, like people are like stronger than you and whatnot. But I was a little bit intimidated, but thanks to the owner, Tony, shout out to Tony. He was a really cool dude in Orlando Boxing Club. He, he when I, I asked him like, hey, what, what do you want me to get? Do you want me to get a group session? And he was like, you know what? Like, I'm gonna give you, give you all the creative control, like do whatever you wanna do. Like just film whatever you feel is like you're gonna film. And I was like, all right, all right. like say less. Like I, I like that. I wanted the people to feel like, like the punches, the uh, ah, and the, even this kid's nose was like bleeding at the end of the session, which actually gave me a headache and I wasn't being hit. And the kids were smiling and hugging after, which, which shows good sportsmanship, but that's not something I'm used to because I haven't been around boxing, but hopefully I can start working with them and that would, that would be pretty amazing, but here's the video. As you just saw in the video, I tried my best to really like capture like all these details that like kind of made that gym what I felt that really made that gym stand out. I definitely haven't been to a lot of boxing gyms, but I feel like this was a great first start because I know there was a ring. There was a lot of different type of varieties of bags. As a trainer, I know that's okay. Like this seems to be like pretty legit. Like, and they have professionals there, like amateurs about to be professionals. So I was really surrounded by like a, an amazing environment, amazing staff. Everyone was friendly. They were all like, they all wanted, they, they all, they all wanted and felt excited of me filming there, which made me excited. I was like, oh, you know what? Like, I'm really gonna try my best. That's all I have for you guys today. This was my first episode, hopefully of many. And if you guys liked it, just make sure to drop a like, subscribe if you really want to. If not, you could check out my socials. They're all Weights and Hoops Studios. That's where I really do most of my work. I try to make the most out of gapping. Am I saying this right? Bridging the gap between the filmmaking world and the coaching world because right now with social media, as a personal trainer, I've always wanted someone to be able to film me. So I'm trying to bring what I would have wanted as a trainer to film, hopefully to trainers in the Orlando or Central Florida area. And this is gonna be a great start. I'll see you guys in the next one.